Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Raghuvir. In this class, we do some practice examples on the formula of e union. In our previous class, we clearly discussed about the formula, axioms of probability, and there we discuss, we clearly explained about the formula. Please watch that class and come back here. The link for the playlist is provided in the description below. Be based on the assumption that you already have the basic understanding of uh, our previous classes, the explanation is provided here. So coming to these examples, uh, toss two dice. This is what our uh, our uh, experiment is tossing two dice. Uh, e is an event uh, that is uh, the event should have a sum of some of the values on the dice should be greater than nine. So greater than nine means it should be ten union. It should be eleven union. It should be twelve. Any anything can be happen. So ten union eleven union twelve. That is given as 10 is what's the events that comes under 10 5 comma 5 6 comma 4 4 comma 6 what's the uh, events that comes under the uh, elements that comes under 11 6 comma 5 5 comma 6 uh, under 12 6 comma 6 all these are disjoint events there is no common element between these three sets these three events so we discussed the equation uh, what's the equation if you have the probability of e is given as probability of e1 event e1 plus e, probability of event e2 plus probability of event e3 that is 3 by 6 this is 3 by 6 3 by 36 what's the possibilities total sample space is uh, 36 is our uh, sample space uh, 3 by 36 uh, so the basic uh, examples were already discussed hoping that you know why we got this 36 value and how why we got these values based on that uh, we are uh, we are not explaining clearly about this why we uh, 3 by 36 plus 2 by 36 plus 1 by 36 so total probability is 6 by 36 because these are disjoint events coming to the second example take a deck of card our event e is given as paid or yes in spade we are having 13 cards in that we are having one yes is involved in that 13 cards Second option is a or you can take you can pick an ace from the deck of cards total in the deck of cards We are having 52 cards. We are having four ace cards will be there in that in that four cards paid ace is involved Means the spade of ace of spade is having a common element these two sets is having a common element which is a spade ace common to both the elements so what's the equation we have discussed in our previous class uh, probability of e1 union U e2 is equal to probability of e1 plus probability of e2 minus uh, probability of e1 intersection e2 e1 means you can pick any spade card means 13 cards are there 13 by 52 plus uh, any ace card 4 by 52 minus uh, intersection is 1 by 52 one ace card is there which is common to both uh, 1 by 52 that is equal to total 16 by 52 this is how we use the union equation which we discussed previously hope you understand these examples if you have any questions regarding the concept please post your questions in the comment section below thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates thank you